Elon Musk, the Tesla CEO, is known for surprising audiences with cutting-edge technology and out-of-this-world gadgets. There's a strong possibility an electric automobile that can fly will be produced soon. Hello guys, welcome to Tecmo. Today, in this video, we will present you with Tesla's eccentric flying car. Make sure you stay till the end of the video to know how excellent this vehicle is. Elon Musk's eccentric ideas have always astonished space and technology fanatics. His latest design of a flying car, the forthcoming Tesla Roadster has once again wowed the public. It's a win-win situation for Tesla. Tesla has accomplished some incredible feats in the last few years that seemed unachievable at the time. Let's take a look at some of the organization's most recent achievements. Musk said a few years ago that Tesla had built 1 million electric cars, which is a huge number. People's attitudes about electric vehicles have been eternally changed as a result of them. They look to be hell-bent on dethroning gasoline-powered vehicles. In addition, with a range of 402 miles on a single charge, Tesla's Model S became the first electric vehicle to break the 400-mile barrier. According to Tesla, America now has the lowest cost solar panels in history. Tesla is currently focusing on more ambitious plants, such as the Gigafactory in Germany and the Gigafactory in Texas. Creating a stainless steel monster Cybertruck, RoboTaxis, and the much-anticipated second-generation Tesla Roadster? So, where did it all start? The Tesla Roadster has a long history with Tesla, as was the company's debut vehicle in 2006. The irony arises when rumors of a laptop battery-powered car spread on the market. Many people felt the concept was unusual at first, but the lightweight Lotus Architect-based automobile had a range of 244 miles on a single charge when it was presented. Then came the upgraded Roadster 1.5 in 2008, which could sprint from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4.6 seconds. At the very least, that's something. It also has no tailpipe emissions and was powered by rechargeable lithium-ion batteries, which was unheard of at the time. Isn't it amazing that Tesla created a high-performance vehicle that produces no pollution and uses no oil? However, only approximately 2,400 of these high-end automobiles were sold, and most of you are unlikely to recall them today. It started at roughly $109,000, which isn't exactly what the average person would want. When Tesla decided it was time to focus on its Model S car, which got considerable accolades from automobile riders, production came to an abrupt halt in 2012. Tesla learned an important lesson from this endeavor. It wasn't the best experience they could have had, but it did help them get to where they are now. The bulk of us do not enjoy being stuck in traffic. Musk was looking for a long-term solution in the form of a flying vehicle. While Musk's vision of flying cars isn't the most cutting edge, it has long been on his wish list. He triggered the debate when he first raised the potential of launching a flying car in November 2017, Despite the fact that it appeared to be another eccentric idea from the Maverick billionaire, he indicated that he was serious about it in 2019. He also shared a gif of a car that was levitating and emitting blue light from its wheels, implying that their new Roadster would do the same. He even tried to describe his idea, emphasizing how SpaceX technology was used to make it flyable. The proposal was met with skepticism by most, who questioned its practical usefulness. Who could have imagined a car floating through the sky? Musk, on the other hand, burst all the bubbles when he stated that the Tesla Roadster would be released in 2023, a project that was originally planned for 2020, but was postponed as with many other Tesla projects. The man who has long criticized the concept of flying automobiles is planned to show one off in the near future. Isn't it funny? The Tesla Roadster, which will be released later this year, raises expectations for an automobile revolution. Is it safe to infer that Musk's promises and hints point to the availability of a flying car in the near future? Let's take a look at the capabilities of the Tesla Roadster. The next Tesla Roadster will be a fantastic addition to the Roadster genealogy, adopting the name of the original model. When Musk first revealed the idea in 2017, he hinted at its performance. For now, he intends to portray it as a halo vehicle capable of removing gasoline-powered automobiles. You might be wondering what makes the current Tesla Roadster so special. The Roadster, which would set you back $200,000, could travel from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 1.1 seconds. That's right, you heard correctly. It would also have a top speed of 250 miles per hour in a range of 620 miles. Isn't it ludicrous? Hey, that's not all. The most thrilling part is still to come. Musk also mentioned that the next tester model would be a SpaceX limited edition car. Let's take a closer look at those details. Before we move any further, we would appreciate it if you gave the video a thumbs up if you are enjoying it. Please also consider sharing and subscribing to the channel. That would be fantastic. Do you remember Doc Brown's DeLorean hovering in midair? 
Lifting these Tesla Roadsters looks to be Musk's idea as well. The car would be equipped with cold gas thrusters to boost its performance and allow it to fly, albeit for a short time, meaning that it would not be a fully-fledged flying vehicle but will undoubtedly lift above the ground. Was the purpose of the thruster and how will it help raise a vehicle? Instead of combusting, these rockets would blast highly compressed cold air into the car, giving it an extra boost of acceleration. Musk also plans to incorporate a vital piece of equipment from SpaceX's most popular Falcon 9 rocket, a composite overwrapped pressure vessel tank. It's a little bottle with a thin metal lining that's wrapped with a carbon fiber. These are ideal for keeping pressurized air in a limited amount of area. These will be used as thrusters in the Tesla Roadster, according to Musk. True, however they'd be employed to blow air out of the car's back end or front end, causing the vehicle to accelerate or slow down. As a result, his goal is to place 10 small rockets around the automobile, which will help it accelerate, braking, cornering, and even flying due to the insanely high velocity and momentum. On Earth, it would generate three tons of thrust, enough to lift the car a meter or two off the ground, according to Elon. Is the concept of a flying car on the road feasible? Musk indicated the rockets would only elevate the Tesla Roadster a meter or two off the ground, leading to some questions if the concept could be implemented on a crowded road. Of course, no one wants to be hit by a car speeding down the road. Furthermore, this concept has never been used in commercial cars that are now in the market. Musk's plans to combine rocket thrusters with autos to build road-going spaceships appears doubtful as a result. It would be a challenging path, but nothing is impossible for Elon Musk. His first roadster proved that electric cars could be exceedingly fast. Now we have the future vision, which, to realize, will bring in a technological revolution in the vehicle industry. When the first product, and every subsequent product before it was released, it sounded like science fiction. But today we have the Rimac Automobiles Navara, which accelerates from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 1.85 seconds. It will be fascinating to see if Tesla's addition, with its promised 1.1 second speed, can match that. The question that emerges in the same time span is when this will occur. The general public has been eagerly anticipating news about this future miracle. The Tesla Rosa has been delayed since 2017, when it was first unveiled, and then pushed back to 2020. It will now be launched in 2023, but only if 2022 does not turn out to be a disaster, as Musk predicted, with all the hype surrounding it. We're hopeful that the wait will be worthwhile. Well, the options are unlimited right now, but who knows? Maybe we'll see a Tesla Roadster to take to the skies in 2023. What are your thoughts on this? Is it possible that Tesla will release the second generation of Roadsters in 2023? That's all for now. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content. Let us know what you think about the Roadster 2 in the comments section below. Until next time.